I can hear the demons call when they do what they do And now I feel like taking off, find a place with a view The pain is never gonna stop if it's controlling you Alright, I didn't really do like a video yesterday besides my uh, protein haul Um, I don't know, I, I don't really have a lot to say I'm very much in my head right now and I, I don't know why, it has nothing to do with the program I'm on. It has nothing to do with anything um, related to this bodybuilding journey. Um, I'm just having a hard time. I um, The summer schedule with the kids is killing me. Um, I think I have a college girl that's going to help with it. She's tried, um, or not tried, she's tested it out the last couple days. She's not available every day, but hopefully it'll take the edge off. Um, I've had a lot of preteen hormonal attitude from my children, which doesn't help. I think, like, I'm not really physically exhausted right now. I'm just mentally depleted. Like, I don't, I, I don't even have words, clearly. Um, I just don't have any mental bandwidth. So, like, I don't know. Today, for example, I got home, and I, I don't sit down until I'm ready to, like, be done for the day. So, like, I got home, you know, took care of feeding the animals, you know, blah, blah, blah. And I went down in the basement to do my um, PM workout, my strength workout. And I was doing that. And I thought I had checked it earlier and I didn't need to go to Anytime Fitness for any machines, but apparently I do for two of them. So I'm like, all right, fine. I'll do the stuff I can do here and then I'll run over to Anytime real quick and do the two machines, come back, grab my son, take him to swimming, and then my husband can pick him up or whatever. But I got upstairs and I was like, well shit, I can't go. I don't have my little fob thing to let me in. And I know like I could have probably gotten someone to let me in, but you're not supposed to. And I don't know, it's a whole thing. I'm sure it wouldn't have worked out. So then I was like, okay. I have like 45 minutes, I can't start anything, I can't, like it's just, it was just a weird amount of time. My husband had my car because it was getting a bunch of stuff done to it, so, um, yeah. And I asked him what his ETA was and it wasn't going to be soon enough, so I had to take his car to go get, to drop my son off at swimming, then come back, get my car, and now I'm going back to any time, and it's like 6 o'clock. And I know it's just going to be grossly crowded, probably. Maybe not. I don't know. I haven't been there um, at this hour before. But I didn't want to deal with the after work people. But apparently I am. I'm trying to do these two exercises. Get home, shower, and put my pajamas on. And just try to mentally regroup. Um do it all again tomorrow. I got a lot of stuff going on at work too. Hiring people is impossible right now. I don't understand. I don't understand how you can apply for a job, set an interview, and not show up for the interview. Not tell anyone. Just totally waste someone's time because that's been happening a lot. Um, the resumes I'm seeing are just like spell check. Please spell check. If you can't spell the job title, you probably shouldn't be applying for the job title. I don't mean to offend anybody, but it's... <sighs> seems pretty basic. So, anyway, I'm just in a mental rut. Um, I'm hoping I can climb out of it soon. 
hopefully over the weekend. I just need to get through tomorrow, basically. It's my only goal is just get through right now. So, is what it is. Yeah, no, I can't. I can't. I went in there, oh, oh my God. Never again am I going in there at like six o'clock at night. Holy shit, was it a fucking happy hour up in there. I can't. I'm sure, I'm sure they all have friends there they see all the time and stuff like that, but I was just like, eh, my god, not for this introvert. Mm -mm -mm. It's too much. Um, I did the one machine that I literally have no options to replace with. I mean, not done. I guess I could do dumbbells or something, but I did that. And I was supposed to do like the double cable crossover and there were these bros that were there and they were just going from one exercise to the next exercise using it. And I get it, like they were on a thing, but like, I was not about to stand there and wait for whenever the fuck they were going to finish all of whatever it is that they were doing. Because they were just, it's not like it was just one set, they just kept doing different things and bringing benches over and off like that. I'm going back home and I'm going to do, instead of doing the double cable fly, I'm going to do a single cable fly on each 